Letitia Greer, and I want to introduce to you a product that we have that's really helped us improve and just really advance our weaving abilities. We have clients sometimes that have a high forehead or have lost their hair. This product is by my daughter, Cecilia Johnson. We produce it and manufacture it at Adidas Hidden Hair. You're gonna absolutely love this product. Now, if you have a client that has a high forehead or have lost their hair in the front, and even on the sides, we have a few different types, you're gonna be amazed and you're gonna love the way this product helps you and gives you the ability to give you a really nice weave and makes your client feel more secure about their hairline. Now we have custom hair systems that you can actually bond and you don't have to worry about that. But if you have a client that's wearing a weave or she's wearing a system and has a high forehead and doesn't like to have anything bonded down, this is the product for you to be able to give your client a really nice, secure weave or system placement. Now, I'm gonna come back in just a few minutes and show you how this product works. Let me show you. It comes in a little bag, just like this packaging, and it is amazing. It comes with a, this is your base, and it comes with a protector uh, net. You always want to be able to cover your client's hair and have it in between the weave or the system. So when you sew it down, you don't want that to intertwine with their actual hair and their braids. Not good. So I'll be back in just a minute and I'm gonna show you how this amazing product works. Okay, now I'm back. Now I have my protective net on this mannequin here and I'm gonna show you how you Place this on your client's head. Let me adjust that a little bit. So what I do, her curve is a little defined here, it's really low, but this will fit just fine. So let me show you. I'm going to place this on, just like so. And what I do is I hold it here in the middle, and I put a clip or two right here, right on that braid, bring one around here, because I want to keep this position where I, where I want this to um, center in the front here. Now you could ask your client to hold it, you know, if you wanted to, but I like to just be independent and do what I'm doing. They can read their magazine or whatever they want. Now you have the two sides here, so I just take a piece of the thread and I sew it through here and I put a lock stitch on it. You can do it two times if you like just to make sure. All right, so now I take that and I bring it all the way around. It doesn't have to be very tight if, not, if you don't want it. And I bring it to the other side here. And now I'm able to pull this and make it as snug as I want to, just like so. Now what, what I do is I take this, I'm not sure, and do my sewing on the side, right here. Do another lock stitch here, and this just proceed to start sewing show you here. I'm going to try to do this as fast as I possibly can so you can see the results. I'm very, very excited about it. And I know you're going to be as well. Finger across where that braid is, and that's going to be your guide to where you're going to be sewing. I like to do a tuck and roll uh, stitch, and I just control the tension with my finger because it really gives me a better... I weave the exact same way as well. So you can see what I'm doing so far. Okay, I'm back. I got this started, I got some hair here. So I I like to, well, a lot of you use a curved needle. I like to use a straight needle, but the curved needle is great for this. You're gonna come through here and put your, your needle right through here. You'll see how easy this is and how it works so well. Keep the hair where you want it, bring it up, 
This is one of the reasons why I do a tuck and roll all the time when I sew weaves. Just want to give you a little idea and show you just how easy it is. So this is all you're going to do. You just have more of an extension to put your, your hair on your client. And it'll be nice, it'll be smooth. You go through here as well. If you're doing a closure, I'm gonna show you how to do a closure as well. But you just continue and do your weave like you normally do, and she's gonna have a better hairline, and she's gonna feel so secure with her new um, hairline base. You'll love it. One.